Hi everyone, it's Miss Yule. In today's video, we will be able to identify the parts of the coordinate plane. So you're all thinking to yourselves, what's the coordinate plane? The coordinate plane is made up of a horizontal number line called the x-axis. Horizontal means we're going left to right, it's kind of like laying flat and a vertical number line called the y-axis. And the y-axis um, goes straight up and down. Vertical is kind of like your standing, straight up and down. So there's the x-axis in blue, goes side to side. It's kind of like, a, it looks like a normal number line. And then the y-axis goes up and down. And it's like a number line that's going up and down rather than left to right. So you'll notice we have positive values, we have negative values, um, we've got negatives over here, and we've got negatives down here, we've got positive values here, positive values up here. So we're going to talk about um, how all of those come into play with our coordinate plane. Um, ordered pairs are a part of the coordinate plane, and they show a position on a graph. The first number is the x value. And the second number is the y value. Here is an example of, a, of an ordered pair or how an ordered pair is written, x comma y. Our x value goes first and our x values go along the horizontal x-axis and the y values go second along the y-axis. You'll see in another video that I posted um, how to graph and locate ordered pairs. Um, one special ordered pair is the origin. The origin is the center of the coordinate plane. It's the very middle, zero, zero. This is where the x and y axis meet. It's called the origin. It has the ordered pair zero, zero. So this is when x is zero and when y is zero. So it's right in the middle where these two axes meet each other, it's the origin. The order, blah, 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 blah. the coordinate plane is made up of four quadrants. So when we had this picture over here, you can see the x and y axis kind of make four boxes. And those four boxes or four parts of the coordinate plane are called the quadrants. So here's the four of them here. When you see the quadrants, they are commonly referred to or named by Roman numerals, which is just a different way of writing numbers. So in Roman numerals, one is just like one um, mark, or it's like it's kind of like an I, it's one I. And quadrant one is when all of my values are positive, when X is positive and Y is positive. Quadrant two, with the Roman numeral two, is like two I's, two I's, two. And quadrant two, the x values are negative, so all of these values over here are negative, but my values going up and down are positive, so x values are negative, y values are positive. Quadrant 3 is down here, and both x and y are negative, so my x values going this way are negative, and my x values going down are negative, and it's three marks, three i's. And finally, we have quadrant four, and the Roman numeral for four is an I and then a V. So quadrant four, my X values are positive going this way, and then they're negative going down, so positive and then negative. Something that is kind of interesting is looking at the way our quadrants go. So we start up in the right-hand corner. Here's quadrant one. And then it goes in a circle this way, and we call that counterclockwise. It goes in a counterclockwise circle. So you start at the right, and then go to the left, then down, then back to the right. All right, let's do a little quick check on these parts. Identify parts of the coordinate plane. Take a second and see if you can remember where Pikachu is located. So Pikachu is located in quadrant two, quadrant two. So this would be quadrant one, quadrant two, quadrant three, and quadrant four. 
All right, where is Squirtle located? Squirtle is located at the origin in the center where our x-axis and y-axis meet each other, the origin. Okay, next one, where is Charmander located? Charmander is located on the y-axis. The y-axis is our axis that goes up and down. It's vertical, like standing. And finally, where is Geodude located? Geodude is located in quadrant four. So remember, it goes one, then two, then three, then four.